Okay, we are going to start with understanding statistical questions. So what is a statistical question? That is a question that can be answered by collecting many pieces of information or data and then summarizing that data. So the key is that you're collecting many pieces of information, more than just one thing. That's your data and then you are summarizing that. So part A, consider the following questions. Question one, in what month is your birthday? Question two, what month has the most birthdays of students at your school? What is the difference between the two questions? Well, question one can be answered using just one piece of information. You answer with your birthday, July 28, obviously. Okay, so question two can be answered by collecting many pieces of information and summarizing them. So based on that, we can conclude that question two is a statistical question. In answering that question, we would be collecting many pieces of information. All right, so hopefully we kind of get the idea of that. So let's take a look at just a couple more examples to drive it home. Part B, does each graph represent the answer to a statistical question? So in this case, we're not being told the question, but we can see um, answers to some question, right? So let's ask ourselves: well, what was the question being asked that produced these answers? And is that a statistical question? So if you look at the first graph, the data that we see is, um, well, first of all, distance travel to school. That's what we're talking about. So we can see student ages versus distance in miles. So I can see how old a student is and how, what their distance was traveling to school. So the question that is being answered would be, how far do you travel to school? So this question is a statistical question because it's answered by gathering and summarizing um, varying data about students. We have gathered their ages, their distance traveled. We're able to summarize that. So this is a statistical question. Okay, our next graph, if we take a look at what we're looking at here, um, the title of our graph is travel time at 20 miles per hour average speed, if that is your average speed. So we can see that we're tracking how long it takes to travel a specific distance, however many miles. And we also know that we're going at 20 miles per hour. So the question that's being asked that is producing these answers is, how long does it take to travel X miles at 20 miles per hour? So in this situation, you know, what data would, be, would we be collecting? Would we collect um, many pieces of data. Um, so that's not what's going on here. There is a predetermined answer. Um, the answer varies predictably with X, so it is not a statistical question. Okay, let's just uh, take a look at a couple more quickly here. So part C, determine if the following are statistical questions. So we're provided with a question now. Um, 
Which is the most popular visual art form? Photography, painting, sculpting, or drawing? Could we collect many pieces of data and summarize them to answer this question? Yes, we could. So is this a statistical question? Yes, this is a statistical question. All right, how many lithographs were created by the artist M.C. Escher? Question mark. <laughs> uh, well, that just has one answer, right? We could do a little research, get an answer. Are we gathering many pieces of information? Are there that we can summarize lots of data? No. There's just a, a, an answer, right? Whatever it is, I don't know. But so this is not a statistical question.